Hello guys, today we're gonna do a comparison between J6 Plus and A7. These smartphones are both from 2018. So, we're gonna look at the specs. We have 3 gigs of RAM, 32 gigabyte, gigabyte of storage, and infinity display. We have dual cameras on the back and the fingerprint scanner on the rear. So, now to look at the phone so now as we can see we have the dual camera set up here and as the box says we have 13 and 5 megapixels so respectively 13 megapixel and 5 megapixel also we have a front facing camera of 8 megapixels Now we're gonna look at the A7. A7 has triple cameras on the back and comes with Super AMOLED display, 4 gigs of RAM and 64 gigabyte of storage. So the special thing on this phone, on the A7, are the cameras. Now, as you can see, we have one, two, three cameras. Each camera has different megapixel, so we can see now 24 is on the main camera. We have a 5 megapit megapixel lens and an 8 megapixel lens. So also we have a front facing camera of 24 megapixels. Now the storage of this phone is 64 gigabytes also comes with 4 gigabytes of RAM so continue by turning on the phones so as we I forgot to tell you that these smartphones have the finger fingerprints on the rear so on the right side this also serves as a button but also is a fingerprint sensor so now we're gonna turn them on and see who turns on first. One, two, one, two, three. Looking on the box, we see that A7 is much more better from the J6 Plus. Okay. We need to wait and see. turned on first now we're gonna wait so the J6 plus turned on so the J6 plus turned on but turned on after a while These are the maximum lights of the screen. So you guys can see a bit more. Mentions tell that it's worth telling, I mean it's worth telling that the A7 has a Super AMOLED display while J6 Plus does not. Now as we can speak and look at the no recent App. No recent apps. So we have to gonna press at the same time the phone A7 wins here. We're gonna press at the contacts. Still A7 messages. We have a seven. We're gonna 
just by scrolling it I don't know if you guys can see on the camera but just by scrolling up and down up and down the phone we see that a7 is much more faster than J6 plus has a better response time so now we're gonna continue by opening calendar but still J6 plus is far behind I'm gonna open radio I'm gonna open clock I'm opening these apps because these apps require a minimum a minimal RAM usage so I'm gonna open Facebook which is a big app and you see A7 load it faster even though it requires an update it doesn't mean that the notifications slow it down in the A7 you know blow up YouTube still YouTube blows faster even though we are on a browser so A7 is like one second faster than the J6 plus you gonna open YouTube app So, now as you can see, YouTube low added much more slower on the J6 and much more faster on the A7, even though it's outdated and needs an update. But we're not gonna do the update now. I'm just gonna check the resolution of the video. So, I'm gonna open this video here. Check the resolution. So, as we see, the resolution on the J6 Plus is 720p, and on the A7 it's 1080p.
my hand is big. time much more than the A7 will. So I'm gonna turn the phone off now. The A7 is a much more better phone and is our winner here but uh, it's much more expensive than the J6 Plus. The A7 co will cost you about 280 euros or around 300 bucks US dollars or you have J6 plus that will cost you around 200 euros and probably around 220 dollars US dollars but it's the best value for money this phone but it will slow down through time this will not slow down through time and if you have the money to buy the A7 just go for it without any regrets and better looks these phones are practically the same on the outside because see we have the same place on the finger fingerprint scanner the thickness is probably the same we have a headphone jack on the both phones but we don't have type C charger we have a normal video comment 